Google Camera Port is one of the best alternative to replace stock camera on any Android device which is available for almost all Android devices available in the market having camera to API enabled. And if on any device camera to API is not enabled then you can enable it by giving the root access on the device. Today in this video we will be taking a look at best Google Camera Port for OnePlus 3 running Android Pie. Before that, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. So here is my OnePlus 3 which is running Oxygen OS 9.0 which was Community Beta 1. So if you are running on Android Pie, Camera to API is pre-enabled on that. So you don't have to do any extra steps to enable Camera to API. Now first of all, I'll tell you which application to be used and what are the configuration for that specific application to get everything working on Google Camera. Main page link will be given in the description below. So this is the XDA thread where you can go and get the APK. So the application which I have used is version 1.5. I'll also put up the direct link in the description below so you can download it from there. First what you have to do is you need to install this Google Camera APK. After that you need to download this configuration file which is .xml file that also I'll put up a direct link in the description below you just need to tap on this file and the file should download as I've already downloaded you can see here which says do you want to download this file again so I would cancel it and once you have downloaded this file but before that make sure Google camera application have been installed then what you have to do is you need to go to file manager go to internal storage and here you need to create a subfolder which is gcam make sure g is in caps and cam in small letters once you create this folder you need to again open it and here you need to create a folder called config wherein c is again in capital letter followed by ongfigs once you have created these folders you need to locate the config file which you have downloaded so as i use my device to download it is available here so this is the configuration file copy this file from here and you need to place it inside the gcam folder under which we have one more folder that is config so place that file over here so as you can see i have already placed it once you have done with that then you need to open google camera once you open google camera tap on this black empty space double tap here and it will ask you to choose the config file which you have placed it inside gcam folder so here you can see this was the file just select this file and tap on restore that's it now close google camera now again open google camera and you'll see everything working over here so first of all let's go to settings and here in photo settings by default you have resolution set to 16.1 megapixel in front camera you can choose maximum resolution up to 8 megapixel under video recording you can shoot video at 4k resolution 1080 and 720p front camera can record videos up to 1080p with this camera application there are no issues with the portrait mode under video recording you can change frames per second to 30 and max up to 60 and slow motion is the only thing which won't work on Android Pie. This will only work on Android Nougat if your device is running Android 7.0 or 7.1.1. Night side is also a cool feature which they have implemented on Google Pixel 3 devices and same can be used on our OnePlus 3 or 3T. Pictures taken in night mode are really great if you compare it with the normal mode. So these are the few photos which I have taken using Google camera. And if you guys still use OnePlus 3 or 3T in taking pictures then I would suggest you to use this specific Google camera APK which will give you far better images than your stock camera. So guys this is the specific application which you can use it on your OnePlus 3 or 3T running Android Pie that is Oxygen OS 9.0 and if you still have any kind of questions you can let me know in the comment section below. As of now only this much in this video hope you like the video and if you like the video then do give me a thumbs up. Also if you are new to my channel then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching have a great day.